1945, the war in Europe, Belgium. Soldiers of the 82nd Airborne Division, 551st Parachute Regiment. Many already injured from fighting, assault Belgian towns where the enemy is holding up. They take their objective, but at heavy cost. The unit is virtually decimated, suffering more than 85% casualties. Today, many take part in an annual walk that follows the footsteps of those troops, like Rick Holly, whose father fought with a glider detachment here. My father, Corporal Leon Holly, was uh, in the 82nd Airborne, 80th Glider Battalion. Uh, he started in Sicily, Italy, uh, landed in Normandy in a glider, Holland, and the Belgium. The 13-mile walk this year was covered in snow, the same conditions that the soldiers of the 82nd dealt with. Rick's father recently passed away. He was planning on coming this year with his son. I told him if he's coming back here, I'll be his caddy if he'll be my guy. Rick came to take part anyway, just like many veterans and family members of those who fought or even fell here, been doing so for years, retracing their friends, fathers, or grandfathers' footsteps. I was in the march last year, made it, so uh, I knew uh, I, hopefully we can continue this. Uh, in the, but the Belgian people are wonderful to us. Much more than just a walk for Rick Holly and many others. This is a personal calling, remembering their loved ones and honoring their service and sympathizing with what the local town suffered during the occupation and fighting. Every Christmas Eve, my father would toast to the suffering of the civilians. So uh, the Belgian people suffered greatly during World War II. From Basse Badu, Belgium, I'm Army Sergeant Zachary Burke, AFN News.